Welcome back to a new video! Hello! So uh, today I'm making a video for the Gulab group Hooked on Nail. The theme for this month is a bird stone. So I decided to go with Aquamarine Baby. Just because of the reason, 5 March is my hubby's birthday and also 5 March is the date that I married with him. So yeah, I will do my best and try to make a nice, elegant aquamarine nail set with those uh, gorgeous. The first time I will use them girls and boys, the E-Nail Couture Nails, yes! So these are the tapered stiletto 123 go soft gel nail extensions. So yes, first time I'm gonna use them. And uh, I got them from my sweet sister, Dunia de Liva. So honey, thank you so, so much. By the way, I already applied them on my new handle right there. Look how gorgeous they are, right? I know the nails are not perfectly fitting for the hands, but that's with the reason, because I want to make them so they're gonna fit me when I'm done with them, okay? That's also why I will do the thumb. So, today I'm gonna also use some products from Viola Brown Girl. Yes, yes, yes. A whole time ago, she sent me a little friend mail and those gorgeous uh, blue flowers were included in that. So yeah, that's like perfect for aquamarine, right? I will definitely use my piercing kit that I have from BRC Nails. Don't forget guys, I am her ambassador. Use my discount code if you wanna save some money, okay? Always nice to know. So yeah. Um, I grabbed me some other items. By the way, this is coming with BRC, her little piercing kit. It's like a little pin to help you make the hole a little bit bigger. Bigger, bigger. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I will use uh, my uh, fish vices. Uh, you can get those. See, you have them in gold and silver. You can grab you some of these by uh, Divine Sparkly Creations Go Look at them, how gorgeous are these? So yeah, you have them for each zodiac sign. And I also will use this glow in the dark ball. I already put a little ring through the ball and this little anchor because yeah, you know, fishes, ocean, sea, ships, right? So yeah, that's a little bit of my plan. I will also use Divine Sparkly Creations, her beautiful birthday embellishment bag, like that. So we're also gonna use the crystals in here. I'm not sure if I will use the birthday month, the chunky Divine Sparkly Creation glitters or if I gonna use one of her brand new Planet Glow in the Dark Fine Glitter Mixes. So Neptune is also Physis, okay? So definitely wanna use this so it goes together with my Glow in the Dark ball, okay? So the color that we will put on the nails is an I'm Lee color, it's number 113. A gorgeous look at that oh perfect to go for aquamarine right look at that gorgeous by the way lisa choose the color for the nail so thank you girl thank you um and i will also use the tomica liner gel in white to make some veinings and i think that will be the majority of my products I almost forgot to mention, but I will also use one of Shimodon, their old and it's not a glitter, not a flaky. It calls Dazzling Diamond. Oh, it's so gorgeous when you're gonna see it on the nail. I freaking love it. So yeah, that's gonna be it, I think. Okay, so yeah, that's the plan. So let's start and doing it. Okay. Okay, so let's begin with the gel, shall we? 
Look at that gorgeous, gorgeous blue. Oh my gosh. Okay guys, I just did a second layer on my thumb, but I think it's a little bit too light, so I will apply some darker veinings with a 126 also from Aimelie. So let me take some out on here. Oh, that's pretty. She is pretty. Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm. So keep in mind, I uh, did not cure the thumb yet, okay? We're just gonna make some teeny tiny veinings with that darker blue on the light blue, okay? So yeah, if you have like a shaky hand don't be bothered by it because actually that's a good thing <laughs> because you want your lines to be shaky them bleed out and in the meantime while the gel is still wet I'm gonna come in with the white Tomica as well so we can create some of the white veining as well just make sure to don't overdo it with the white though because yeah that white can be uh, pretty strong you don't want it to be overpowering you know And the thing is, because you are working wet on wet on wet, if you mess it up, you cannot fix it. So, yeah, be very careful when you do the veining, okay? And also make sure to wipe your brush when you go back in your bottle the liner brush because you don't want to contaminate your white okay so be very careful with that I'm always wiping on a little wipe wow she is looking pretty good don't you think so I will give her a little flush uh, this is how she looks for now um, I'm going to do the same for the other nails um, and then you will see me back so we can apply some of the glow in the dark glitters and all the other cute decorations, okay? Um, I will speed this part up so it's not taking too long for you guys, okay?
Okay, so for the next step, I will take me some Jelly Clear Sticky Glue Gel from Shimolern and we're gonna apply some beautiful Divine Sparkly Creations Neptune and some She Modern Flakies. I know guys, I know, sadly enough the flakies are not available anymore. Um, but yeah, definitely go and check out She Modern because she have a lot, a lot more beautiful things available on her website still, okay? So what I will do is um, I will make two blobs with my glue gel, like that, so I can mix in the beautiful glitters. So let's start with Neptune. So remember guys, the Neptune is a glow in the dark as well, okay? It is so freaking cool. So definitely go and check out Divine Sparkly Creations, guys. She is brand new. Oh, she has so many beautiful products. So just be a little bit patient with her because, yeah, she is still adding everything on the website while I'm speaking. Um, but yeah, I am sure, guys, I'm sure that you're gonna love everything that you have. Okay, I just need something. To mix my beautiful Neptune a glitter in the gel with, you know what I mean? Just like that. I think I will apply it with my ombre brush. Get off little dudes, we don't want to waste ya. Let's make a mix with my sheet Modern Diamond Dazzle. Yeah, that's gonna be so beautiful, <laughs> trust me guys. A little stir and then we can play because I think my nails are cured already wow look at that you can already see the diamond sparkle right I hope we will have enough we will see right let's try it out with my thumb first so we can see how it gonna turn out Better keep it on screen for you guys, right? Otherwise, it's gonna be hard for you to see what I'm doing, right? I start to think that maybe it would be better to just apply the glue gel on the nail and then like apply the glitters directly on it. We will see, right? Don't want to cover up the beautiful marble I did as well, you know. Let's see. What will happen if we come in with a diamond? Oh yeah. She will give us that like, just that little extra pop, you know what I mean? Let's cure my baby up. Let's switch my opinion. I first gonna apply a coat of my sticky glue gel over all the nails. Um, and then I will apply the loose glitters on top of that, okay? So if you work with the She Modern glue gel, apply a really, really thin coat, okay? You really don't need a lot. 
The more you will use, the more you will bulk out your nails. And that is something you don't want to do, right? Normally, when you work with this glue gel from Shimoda, normally you cure it first for one minute. I'm not gonna do that though because I want to be able to uh, move my glitter around a little bit, if that makes any sense. So yeah, let's do that on all my nails, right? These are looking gorgeous. So yeah, if you want to stop right there, that's a set already, right? But you already know me, right? <laughs> it would be not sassy if we don't do something extra. So I'm coming in now with the loose glitter from Divine Sparkly Creation. Starting with that first. I'm trying to like, you know, don't let too much, but we do want to make sure that it is uh, visible, right? So let's first do the Neptune on all the nails. And then I will come in with the diamond. So this is how the nails are looking for now. Pretty neat, right? So what I want to do first is I want to give them a top coat. But I'm also curious how they would look with matte. So let me just do the thumb with the jelly matte clear no wipe top coat from She Modern. Because I want to know how they would look matte. And then I will decide what I will do for the other nails if that makes any sense yeah. so yeah if you're using matte make sure that you cover the complete complete nail otherwise it really gonna look funky okay okay I think we have everything so let's do it So curious to see how this will look matte guys I really am so yeah for the glow in the dark part we need to wait for that mm -hmm. oh wow look at that that's not looking too bad right it's actually looking pretty nice okay you know what I'm gonna ask my girl what she thinks and I'm gonna go with her opinion, okay? <laughs> I just consult my girl. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna do half in matte and half in uh, shiny, okay? Because I really love them matte. But she really loves them shiny, so that's what we're gonna do. So let me first finish the matte nails. Oh, Lisa, you're gonna be happy. The accent nail is gonna be, yeah, shiny. Yes. <laughs> she's going like, yes. Yeah, she's really happy with that. Okay, so let me finish the top coat off because I really wanna protect these nails and then you're gonna see me back for the next step. This okay. is how they're looking now. I will do those two with glossy after I pierced a little hole in this finger. So to do that, I will remove it out of my hand because I don't want to damage my hand dolly. So here is my nail and you can see she's not thick at all, right? So let me first put my, uh, my little drill together. So if you are looking for a nail piercing kit, definitely, definitely go and go with BRC Nails. Use my discount code. So here is her shop because she have like oh, such amazing beautiful piercing kits 
She has a small one, she has a big one. Okay, I want it on the outside, so it will go on this side. So yeah, definitely go and check her out, okay? So I think I will do it right there. So you just hold it down and you start turning your little device. Don't put too much pressure on it because you don't want to break the nail as well. And there we go. A clean cut, like you can see. I always like to go like a little bit, you know, back and forth. So what we're going to do next is I'm going to use my little needle. She applies it together in her piercing kit. And guys, trust me. This is like a, a god scent, okay? So you push it in the hole because trust me, your your little rings they're probably not gonna fit at all. So you wiggle and you push carefully at the same time until the needle goes through. But can you see the difference? How thick the needle is and how thin that the little drill is. That's why she is providing you with a little iPad like that. How smart is that, right? I only hope that I <laughs> that I put my hole on the correct place. I'm a little bit scared to be honest that I put it a little bit too high up. We will see, right? So like that. So now I first gonna give this nail a shiny top coat. I will go for the satin just because for my end pictures, okay? If I'm gonna use a high gloss, guys, trust me, you will not see a lot from the design, so. So make sure to cover the whole nail. Don't you worry about the little hole because you can always like just pierce it through after it's cured, okay? Like that. Use my little torch because that's easier right now. And then I'm gonna loop in my glow-in-the-dark ball and my anchor. By the way, you can also find like a lot of beautiful piercings in BRC Nails or shop as well. Like little crystals, uh, little other, other little tangles. She also have like a lot of kawaii and girls and boys, trust me, the new products that she is coming up with. Mm -mm -mm. You gonna love it, trust me, I know I do. I already have a couple of them. I will show them soon as well, but yeah, I'm sure you're gonna love them. <laughs> Some of them are glow in the dark girls and boys, yes. Okay, let's see if that is cured. It is totally cured. So, oh, by the way, something new that you will have in BRC, her piercing kits are these little ring tools let me tell you these are amazing okay you just put it inside of the ring and then you twist one end and there you go nice and open so let me first put the little anchor on there and now the hard part Okay, so my anchor came off again, so let's just flip it over again like that. And now we need to close that hole. So to close it, I will use my second plier. Go like that. And now we will squeeze them together. Make sure they're like nice and close to each other. Nice and straight. And after that, I will like put it like that. So there we go. I have a little anchor and a little ball. So I already took some crystals out from Divine Sparkly Creations. I uh, will show a picture on screen from what these are if I already have the pictures. Because remember guys, Divine Sparkly Creation, she is a new, brand new web shop. So yeah, she is still adding all her products on the website. You can see like a little 
peek from some things that's gonna go on Divine Sparky Creations. Everything in this box will come on her web shop. Yes, 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 and a lot more, let me just tell you. So, let me take a look what I wanna take out. So like you can see, there is a lot in here, isn't it? Woo hoo hoo, look at that. Something for everybody, you know? Um, I definitely need my aquamarine out of the birthday goodies. So, like you can see, hopefully see, this is a mix. Flat backs and pointer backs. So here I have another one, aquamarine. So they are different, guys. I hope you can see it. But this one is lighter than this one. So I will grab those two containers. And I'm not sure, but... These are all oh, Borealis crystals, and they're oh, freaking, freaking gorgeous, right? Well, these are not oh, Borealis, like you can tell, but all the rest is. So, yeah, I think I'm just gonna take them out, just gonna grab them, and if I wanna use them, I will use them, okay? So, let me close this up again for now. I also picked up my Divine Sparkly Creations Caviar Beads. This is a filler that she will have that will go in the birthday embellishment goodies or separately. I'm not sure how she will do it, but you have silver, gold, and these are like, oh, I love them so much, guys. The RAB. Oh my freaking God, look at that. Why did I not put on my second light? There we go. I really hope you can see it better now, but these are A, B ones. So the jar next to it are a little bit smaller. So I think, I don't know if I will use the gold or the A, B ones, but yeah. Um, I took those so, out. Of course, I took me some real aquamarine crystals. So these are the real deal guys to go on my nails. Let's do the doing, shall we? I think I wanna start first with the zodiac sign. So the zodiac sign will go on my ring finger. This is a nice thick gel guys. So I will spread it open just where I want the zodiac sign to go. I don't know when it fell out with filming guys, but I just placed the viola brown her ooh, flower and I was thinking to try and see if I can place one of the real aquamarine stones in the middle of the flower. So this is a real aquamarine. Oh, that's gonna be so gorgeous guys. I can already tell. It's gonna be so beautiful. Like that. Just put her straight in the middle. And of course, we're gonna a flush cure that as well. Okay, I hope it's gonna keep recording now because I think my batteries are getting low from my remote control or something. I don't know what it is, but my phone is always falling out for some reason. I am so, so sorry, guys. Okay, I think I wanna try. Let's see how it will look. Some real aquamarine stones right there. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see them. I know they're there, but yeah, I don't know if you guys will see them. That's a shame though, because it is really pretty. Let's do like drop down like that let me take one out of here I need a flat back like that let's put you there I'm gonna remove the real ones guys because 
There's no point, you cannot see them. I think I will replace them with the uh, aquamarine flatbacks from uh, Divine Sparkly Creations. be better that will be so much better right okay so let's see what we can do here Okay guys, so <coughs> here she is, all completed. What do you think? I freaking love the way how she came out. Look at the thumb as well, right? So uh, yeah, do you think she is aquamarine worthy, yes or no? Definitely let me know, okay? But I really, really love her. I really do. Look at that, right? So yeah, I think I'm gonna leave you for now. I really hope that you liked the video. Don't forget to also watch to all the other ladies uh, on Instagram and also here on YouTube from the Hooked on Nails collaborations. We cannot forget to look at the glow in the dark part, right? So let me go to a darker room and show you the glow in the dark part as well. Are you ready for it? I hope you are. There we go. And yeah, I hope I see you all back in my next video. Give these a big kiss and bro. Rawr! And stay a sassy. Bye-bye, uh, everybody. I love you all, and I see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>